everyone. I know it's been a while since I put up a video. Um, I haven't just I haven't felt up to it. A lot of stuff's happened in the past couple of months, and uh, we have stopped trying to conceive indefinitely. Um, as you know, I had a miscarriage, and that was rough. You know, you hear about it, but you just don't expect it to happen to yourself. Um, the same with C-sections when you're pregnant. You just, you never really want to read about that stuff because you just don't expect to have a C-section. You said, well, I'm going to do it my way and that's how it's going to be. Sorry, it's shaky. I'm holding my phone. Um, anyway, so I had the miscarriage and then a couple days after that, my grandmother passed away. And we were really, really close. Um, we would see each other daily and she was really close to my daughter and so it's just been a rough couple of months uh, trying to get over everything um, so right now we're just we're not trying to get pregnant because I just don't feel like I'm ready for it uh, that's it I've just been throwing myself into other things <clears throat> Sorry, my husband walked in the room. Um, where was I? We, oh, I just don't feel like I am ready for a baby right now with everything. I don't feel it's fair to bring a baby here if, uh, if I'm still grieving over the last baby and my grandmother. And I just, so we're stopping right now. Um, I don't know if we will start again or if Audrey will be our only child. Um, I just don't know right now. I've been trying to keep my mind busy uh, by doing other things, throwing myself into other things. Right now we're trying to get a dog, a Great Dane from a rescue in Dallas. And that's been my new thing. Uh, hopefully we'll get that soon. It's a really long process. We had to fill out like a five page application and then have them do a background check on our pet history and then a phone interview and then we will be doing a home visit as soon as they can get out here. Uh, we are about four hours from them so it might take a couple weeks before they can manage to get out here to do the home visit and then after that we will go to meet two dogs that fit the criteria of what we're looking for and hopefully have a new family member. So that's my thing right now and uh, my brother is fixing to move in with us for a little while. He just turned 21 and he's going to start working with my husband. So just trying to get the guest room ready for him and um, families coming to visit next month and then oh my daughter, she's having her half birthday party in a couple weeks. So that's been keeping me occupied too. Her birthday's in December and we have decided this year to do her party on her half birthday so that December doesn't fly by so quickly and isn't quite as expensive since the ho it's, it falls right in between Thanksgiving and Christmas. So it's just event after event after event in December and it's just it's too much so we're gonna try it this year see how it works um yeah I think that's about it oh I did want to address all my haters <laughs> that leave comments on my videos um hey thanks for commenting um as long as you only talk about me you can still watch my videos if you talk about my child, my husband, or my unborn child, hoping that it will die, I will block you. Um, I don't know when all this started to happen in the TTC community. The whole time I watched, there wasn't any negative comments like that. Um, and I've noticed it on a couple other girls' videos who are in interracial relationships. And I think it's pretty shitty of people to do that. It's just, it's pathetic. You're pathetic if you do it. 
So, but hey, haters. So, anyways, um, I think that's about it. I don't know when I will be updating again. I don't know if you guys want to have any more updates since I'm not trying to conceive. And I don't know when we will be trying to conceive. But if you do want videos from me, um, let me know what you'd like to see. Uh, I like to do makeup. I went to culinary school so I could do some cooking videos. Um, I can't really do any videos on my daughter's hair or anything like that. I'm not that great with it. But, uh, you know, if you guys want to see something, let me know. If you have any questions about the miscarriage, go ahead and ask. I'll be fine to answer it. And um, I might do a video if enough people are interested to know, you know, what it felt like, what it entailed. So, all right. Well, I have to go on my date with my husband. He is waiting in the car impatiently, I suspect. So, talk to you later. Bye.